Kochi, known for its idyllic backwaters, rich culture and cuisine. is experiencing development of modern infrastructure at unprecedented scale and speed under the visionary leadership of Prime Minister Narendra Modi. With a thrust towards transformation of coastal areas, development of marine economy and safety of the marine ecosystem. Our nation is witnessing the largest infrastructure creation drive in our history. India is contributing towards a prosperous and resilient world through the clarion call of an Atmanirbhar Bharat. As a step towards creating an Atmanirbhar Bharat, a propylene derivative petrochemical project has been set up at the Bharat Petroleum Corporation Limited's frontline entity, Kochi Refinery. At an approximate investment of 6,000 crore rupees, is set for launching the niche petrochemical revolution. The propylene-based project shall produce acrylic acid, acrylates and oxo-alcohols which have applications in everyday life such as paints, cosmetics, inks and plasticizers. This venture shall lead to an import substitution and about 4,000 crore rupees foreign exchange savings annually. It shall also give rise to the creation of several ancillary industries in Kerala nearby states and the nation itself. Along with this, the deployment of two new roll-on, roll-off vessels between Bolgatti and Willingdon Island. This will cut down a road distance of 25 to 30 kilometers to only 3.5 kilometers in waterways. It will give a fillip to trade with reduced cost and time. Kochi has always been a much sought after cruise destination. To tackle the anticipated demand in cruises, an international cruise terminal encompassing 2,253 square meters has been constructed at Ernakulam Wharf. The Sagarika Cruise Terminal shall cater voyages to Maldives, Colombo and Southeast Asian countries. It is designed to open up a whole new vista of opportunities for the cruise business and the generation of employment. To complement this vision, the Vigyanasagar Marine Engineering Training Institute is all set to emerge as a premium maritime learning center for the country. Sprawling across 3.5 acres, the 70,000 square feet new campus has a capacity of 114 fresh graduates. The outstanding performance of fertilizers and chemicals Travancore Limited, fact, has given rise to the need for the South Coal Berth and it will ensure the quick and efficient handling of cargo at fact and also reduce logistical costs. All these projects involve investments of around 6,100 crore rupees. For completed projects, employment generated during project execution is around 360 lakh man-hours and they shall continue to create more direct and indirect employment opportunities thereafter. Dedication to the nation, Propylene Derivatives Petrochemical Complex, Kochi Refinery, Roro Vessels at Willingdon Island at Kochi, Inauguration of International Cruise Terminal, Sagarika at Kochi, Marine Engineering Training Institute, Vigyanasagar, Laying of the Foundation Stone, Reconstruction of South Coal Berth at Kochi, Today by Prime Minister Narendra Modi.